Although somatic mutations are felt to happen on a tissue base, um, the liquid biopsies allow us for certain advantages, and one big advantage is that we now understand very clearly that many tumors, including lung cancers, are highly heterogeneous. So not only can histologies like squamous cell biology and adenocarcinomas coexist within the same tumor volume, there is also a strong degree of tissue, uh, of molecular heterogeneity identified in those tumors. Yeah. So the liquid biopsy allows for a more comprehensive molecular assessment of the entirety of the tumor burden in any given patient. I agree with that completely. And the other thing that happens is you may have a fairly sizable mass, but not so much tumor cellularity. Might be a lot of inflammatory cells and stroma. So there, you'd be putting needles in there and getting lots of cores, but you might not have enough cells to really, find, you might not find the cells that have the mutation. Whereas a liquid biopsy, if that's in there, it's likely to be circulating in the blood and be able to determine it.